Hey guys, Chris here with TechRecipes.com and today I'm going to be showing you how we can add the Facebook history uh, timeline onto our Facebooks. Um, this isn't released yet, it's set to release sometime soon, I believe this month or even possibly next month, it might just depend on uh, who you are. So we're going to kind of add this onto our own page and only we will be able to see it but it's kinda neat just to see how this stuff works before it's actually released so at the top of your Facebook screen in the search box why don't we type out developer and we wanna click the app developer by Facebook which is this first one here now the next thing you need to do is create an app and I know that seems a little bit weird but don't worry about it nobody can see it just you so to do that you're gonna create new app click create new app um, and basically create your app and go from here you probably will need to validate your Facebook account to do this which means uh, tying in your phone number with it and you'll get a call from them or a text and have to validate it luckily for me I've dabbled in making apps before, so I have some apps created right here. So once you have your app created, it might take a second to register with Facebook, so you can go ahead and wait a minute. But once you have it ready, you can select your app here, and then right here where it says Open Graph, let's go ahead and click Get Started. Now, right here, we can do something really easy. Just watch and learn. Go ahead and type, people can watch a movie. And this is kind of a fake little object of our application. It doesn't really matter. So just kind of type whatever in there and click get started. Now, after we have typed in the people can this and this, and you click get started, you're going to see this screen. Now, we're going to simply uh, just change around a few things on here. Um and be sure we check each tab here save changes and next and this is kinda to make it think we're changing things around this may seem a little shady but trust me I don't think you'll get in that much trouble for it okay now we're on the second thing here let's just change another thing um, change that to book and save changes and next and let's change one more thing here and go ahead and click save and finish there we go so now we have that created and the next step is we wait so basically we're gonna wait I don't know just a few minutes two or three minutes and then we'll go back to the Facebook home screen refresh it and there should be an invite to try the timeline there so I'll go ahead and pause this video and get back with you guys in a few minutes Alright guys, wow, that was super fast. I actually refreshed the page just after that, and here we go right at the top. Introducing Timeline, a new kind of profile. So I guess we can go ahead and click Get It Now. And here is uh, Timeline. This is the developer release. Um, right now, uh, only I can see what's here basically, and uh, so we can click publish now to publish it to the home page and it actually tells you when your timeline goes live and it says mine is set for Friday September the 30th 2011 and that's really neat guys this is a really cool feature just kinda see how you were back in the day and what <laughs> what kinda stuff you said I'm gonna go ahead and close out of this I don't want you guys seeing how weird I was but thanks for watching uh, techrecipes.com and you guys have a good day